The Boston Bulldogs will have a new look this year, and there's probably not a lot of coaches in the Southern Indiana Athletic Conference feeling sorry for Coach Andre Thomas. Mike Jalen Pendleton was the most valuable player in the city and the conference last year. He will be very, very tough to replace. Tough to replace indeed, but they've got some good players, Carrington Crutcher running the ball, and David Greenwood and Saeed Wolcott uh, doing a lot of uh, work up front on the offensive line. Crutcher's been on the varsity field since his freshman year. He's just a junior. He's already getting some looks from Division I schools. Who's going to be the quarterback for the Bulldogs this year? It'll be Bo Burkhardt. And, of course, that name's synonymous with Bossy. His father was a basketball coach there. Last year, Bo did something not a lot of athletes can do. He lettered in four sports. He was not only on the soccer and the football team in the fall, but basketball and baseball in the spring. So he's a very, very good athlete. And, of course, he should lead that offense. But a lot of it's going to rely on Carrington Crutcher. And, again, like Harrison, Numbers might be a factor for Bossy early. They've got to keep those kids injury free. And uh, nine players on defense do return D'Angelo uh, Crenshaw and uh, Aaron Boone. But you're right, Dan, depth is going to be a problem. All right, so Bossy again, their football show, Andre Thomas. You can join him every Monday at 4 30 on ESPN 106.7. You know, really, we want to improve on last year. Uh, last year, we were in three and seven. Uh, I think we finished the year really strong. We were starting to come together there at the end. This year, we just want to kind of piggyback off of that success. And uh, when this thing is over, we want to be somewhere in the mix at the top for City and SIC championship. To get my job done, be as successful as possible on the offensive line. I just want to be successful. You know, I want to lay my heart out on the field. I want to make sure that every play, I never take it off. I want to make sure that every time I step on the field, somebody knows who I am. And I want to make sure that person who lines up in front of me knows that I came to play football. This season, I want to be real successful on defense. You know, just stopping anyone who comes over to my side on the field and just letting my force be known while I'm on the field. From the beginning, Coach, uh, he, he let us know what his, uh, what his beliefs were, the way he wanted to run the program, and uh, what he expected out of us. So we laid it down uh, clear and flat, and uh, we could either abide by it or not play. And uh, he, was, he was stern. I mean, we just want to be successful. I mean, we got a good coaching staff, got a lot of athletes this year. You know, just making sure that everything falls on the play. As long as we listen to coach, everything's going to turn out real good for us. We have a real good uh, relationship with our coaching staff. You know, they're real fun to hang, hang around with um, off the field. But on the field, they mean business. But any other time, you know, they're real good to be around. On defense, they're going to see high-intensity uh, football action. Uh, people getting after the ball, making tackles, making hits. And, you know, as every great coach would tell you, you know, defense wins championships. So this year, you know, we're planning on making our defense the heart and soul of our football team. And as long as we can stop runs, stop passes. They're going to see a lot of excitement and a lot of love and a lot of people just going after it. You know, that's what we do. We're going to bring a lot of excitement, a lot of speed. We're just going to be different this year than we have in the past. I think everybody that played on the defense is a year older, a year stronger, and a year wiser. And we just have very high expectations for them. We're tight like a family is what we always say. And uh, we truly mean that. Don't forget to pick up the print edition of Football Fever at any of these fine locations.